chick that has a YouTube channel uh, named Mars, and she does a lot of video games, and she did this game, and she flipped a coin, and she got Claire uh, to, to play first. And so I decided I'm going to do the opposite, do Leon Kennedy first, so that when I watch her video, I'm not watching the exact same game. There'll be slight variations. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to I'm gonna start with Leon, and then I'll do Claire for Part B. All right. After a few days of radio silence from his new post, Leon Kennedy drives to Raccoon City to scope things out. Unbeknownst to him, a nightmare awaits. Standard. Raccoon City, an industrial city in the heart of America, and the one Leon S. Kennedy was assigned to protect and serve as he drives towards... Well, damn. Didn't give me enough time. Look, man, I'm serious, okay? I saw this with my own eyes. Oh, I believe you, buddy. I believe you. <laughs> Just tell us a story. Tell us a story. Okay, well, it was last Friday night. I was walking home from the bar, and this woman started coming towards me. She was staggering, you know? So I, I figured she was drunk. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, tell us, be honest now, how many drinks did you have? No, man, I, I barely had a buzz on her. Oh, come on. Look, just listen, all right? She got closer, and I got a good look at her. You got to see her eyes, her nose, her whole face. It looked like it was rotting. Yeah. She looked like a corpse, like a walking corpse, man. <laughs> Sounds like my wife. I've never seen anything like it. I haven't been able to sleep since that night. All right, calm down, buddy, calm down. Just, hey, you got to stay strong, okay? Don't give in to fear out there, right? Yeah, well, you got that right. Up around these things, they'll sink their teeth in the middle. Oh, come on, it's just getting good. Oh, I need some sleep. No one's around. That's weird. Explore my surroundings. I'm gonna have a gun right now. To get used to the controls. Oh, they're telling me. Walk. Sprint. Yeah, I can hold L3, yeah. Dingo red cigarettes. When life has you seeing red, enjoy the wild taste of Dingo Red Cigarettes. Get wild. Now on sale. How far can I go? I know I'm supposed to investigate the, uh... Oh, dude. It feels... It's obviously not open world. Look at this. 
Well, now I'm actually scared. <laughs> Can I just go out into the abyss? Okay, no. There is there's a limit. Although it does give you the it does give you the creepiness vibe. Okay. Let's check it out. I see blood. Um Hello? Anybody there? <sighs> Something's not right. Oh boy. I'm so glad I don't deal with loading screens anymore. Vaguely remember all this. Oh God. You all right? Don't move. I'll be back for you. Where's my gun? I'm just a rookie cop. I don't even have a gun yet. Or maybe it's my first. It's my first day on the force, so they haven't given me a badge and gun yet. Oh God! Give him. I love what they did with this remake. They kind of made a hybrid. They gave they gave us the third person action from the sequels, which I really prefer the survival horror. But that's what they did. They kept all the. Officer, you need help? Stay back, sir. I got this. Freeze! Two headshots. Shit! Three headshots. Oh yeah, I forgot. I love the whole. Uh, he's got the flashlight and the gun. He's got the arms crossfired. Crossfire. Oh god! The three headshots, man. Escape the store. I'm already kind of scared. Oh god. Can I... Oh shit. No! Too soon. Too soon to get bit. What the? Lame. Don't shoot. Get down. You all right? Yeah, I think so. Thanks. You can thank me later, when we're safe. Holy shit. He's in his cop car. He's got a gun, so. What the hell is going on? I don't know. Hopefully they'll have some answers at the police station. Wait, you're a cop? Yeah. Leon Kennedy. You are? Claire. Claire Redfield. Live around here? No. I'm looking for my brother. He 
He's a cop, too. Well, it's a good thing we found each other. I don't know what to expect anymore. You're a cop? As we got into a cop car? I'm excited. It's like I'm playing it for the first time. Especially without having to do loading screens and... And like I said, they kept the puzzles in and the... The map and you have to know where you're going. But there's still the third person shooter. Uh, as well, so... Not the auto aim, so. Attention, all citizens. Due to the citywide outbreak. You were advised to take shelter at the Raccoon City Police Station. Free food and medical supplies will be provided to everyone in need. Oh my god, this is so unreal. Police station's not much farther. They'll know something. Yeah, but what if we're the only ones? What if there's no survivors? No, there's survivors. It's a big city. There has to be. Looks like we're walking from here. More like running. Yeah, good call. That would Claire. knock you unconscious. Claire, are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. How about you? you? Can't stay here. It's not safe. Go on ahead. I'll meet you at the station. I'll be there. Oh, yeah. This is out of control. How many bullets do I have? Seven. Save my bullets. Oh, damn it. Where, where do I go? Okay, I did a 180, but the. Shit. It's everybody. They've all turned. Oh God, did not know you were there. So when my character does a 180, the camera angle doesn't, doesn't go with me. Okay, back in X. Back in X for the character, back in circle. There it is, 
the station. Or the camera. In for a treat. <laughs> no loading screen. It's awesome. Thank you, technology. Hello? Is anybody here? kind of wanted to explore the other room. Uh, making use of the map. All the points of interest, items, yeah. Red rooms have items to pick up. Kind of similar to the first game. So, I, and I love how they label them for you this time. Entrance, main hall. I actually just saw me, oh, a lot of doors. I actually wanted to explore the Oh, please tell me I can go back. I didn't mean to... Um, I was gonna... It's down. I wanted to explore the other area. Oh, maybe we can open it here. If only I had a fuse. Storage room key for the gas station. Am I gonna use this again? Definitely need a. I gotta put a fuse back in. God, I'm screwed. Screwed in my first hour. Seven bullets. Jesus. I'm scared of my own. Who's there? You got this. You got this, Leon. We believe in you. Toilet paper. I'm gonna shit my pants real soon. Press room. God, these sounds are creeping me out. That's more like it. Reload option. Yeah. Okay. Aim and push square. 
room is blue, which means I've gotten everything. Maybe I'll come back later. But as of now. I swear I'm so used to loading screens. Oh god. We need a plumber. Mario Brothers. Ah, uh, no reflection. Plus, I would usually take a sip of my drink during each loading screen. This is going to be a lot more fast-paced. I was already here. Something. Open up! Jesus. Hurry! Where? Open up! Open this goddamn door! Okay. I'll get you out! Please! Give me your hand. Help me! I got you. Give me your other hand. statue three medallions or something way out parking okay I vaguely remember all this it was a an enigma to me a little bit with the photos got a unicorn a lion and a goddess what the hell so Sorry, buddy. Well, can I get out? Jesus! That's not cool, bro. Stay down. It needs three headshots, dude. No! God! Still mother. Oh my God! Get the f out of here! How do I get to my inventory? Okay, yeah, use my health. Oh. Jesus. 
Jesus! They're everywhere! I don't have a lot of ammo for them. They coming in? God. Damn it. God, I am legitimately scared. I'm been bit. Oh god. God. I'm out. Good lord. Maybe I should have played on easy. Is that ammo? No. I got nothing to defend myself now. Watchman's room. That's where I got the. Okay, so there was one on. Two on the. Two doors I missed. I'm gonna go to the. To the right. That locked? Oh, you gotta be. They don't tell you they're locked until you try them. They're getting sneaky on you. Well, I have no choice now. Must go to this one door right here. I'm gonna have to try to pass some zombies. God, Lord! Son of a. You chain door. Well, I don't have anything. Chain door. Chain door. Lock door. Cheese box. All the rooms are not red. Go back in the watch. I. I can't do anything. I need the chain, unless it's, and there's no, all the rooms are blue. So I'm missing a, the switch or something. Wait, what the fuck? Nothing in here. Remember, board up the doors. No. I'm gonna die. What am I missing here? I know I forgot to explore the main hall initially, but they wouldn't just screw you over by choosing. I'm a bullshit. This fucking bullshit. I don't... I got nothing. Is that a Come on. Oh, I can go underneath it the entire time. No! safe. 
For now. <clears throat> Thanks. Marvin Brenner. Leon Kennedy. There was another officer I, I couldn't... I couldn't... Here. <clears throat> I'm sure you did what you could, Leon. I Does anyone know what back. started this? Not a clue. But honestly, all you need to be careful. Yeah, well, I was supposed to start last week, and I got a call to stay away. I wish I'd come here sooner. You're here now, Leon. That's all that matters. Okay, Lieutenant. I'm ready. Hopefully, we'll be able to find a way out of this station. That officer you met earlier, Elliot. He thought this secret passageway might do the trick. This is good news. We can get you to a hospital. No, no, I am not the priority here. Lieutenant, I'm not just gonna leave you here. I'm giving you an order, rookie. You save yourself first. I'd come with you, but I'd just slow you down. Now, you'll need this. I can't take it. Stop. And don't make my mistake. If you see one of those things, uniform or not, you do not hesitate. You take it out, or you run. Got it? Yes, sir. <laughs> Yay. Oh, but I'm like dead. Oh, I can sub weapon. So L1. That's right. L1 versus L2. I love how they don't, it is different, they don't explain anything to you like in the other games, with no kind of, they went away from that narration. Find three medallions. Got a statue. Typewriter. I don't even want to save. Kind of an embarrassing first hour. Would be, is there any uh, nothing in the chest for me? Just hoping for some goodies. Just, we don't require ink ribbon. Dang, okay. I've played this game a few times. Assisted, assisted, standard, assisted. Assisted is like easy basically, right? So just go no data. Plenty no datas. The space. I kind of like the idea that you have to have ink ribbon to save, though. It made saving an extra challenging. Uh, now, you couldn't just save whenever you wanted, and you had to find an ink ribbon, and you had a limited number of saves.
Hmm. The three symbols. A few files. Wait. Triangle and R1? Oh, okay, it's just over here. Where am I? I'm the god of statues, so. Woman, arrow, snake? snake. Wait a minute. Oh, that's a lion. I thought it said goddess. Oh, lion statues upstairs. And the, this is the second floor. Your first floor has the goddess statue. Okay, so... Lion... Feather or something. Eagle? <sighs> cool. One down. <sighs> Design. Who's the architect in everything that is Raccoon City? some health. Spade door, right? Yeah. That's right. Four keys for the deck of cards. Leon. Okay. Blue is good. I need... Use a red herb. <laughs> Welcome to Raccoon City. Did you know while we're we are the home of pharmaceutical giant Umbrella Corporation. Raccoon City is a vibrant and dynamic city with a long, rich history of its own. In this guide, we'll introduce you to just a few of the more unusual points of interest our city has to offer. Raccoon City Police Station. The building in the center of town wasn't always a police station. In fact, it used to be an art museum. Various features, like the unusual clock tower and the goddess statue in the main hall, remind us of a bygone era. Orphanage. Just a few blocks from the police station is an orphanage found and run by the Umbrella Corporation with the help of generous donations from businesses and citizens alike. The building is known for its stained glass window which attracts visitors from around the world. Is that it? Kind of going for I need to smoke. Or is that that's a, it's a soda machine? Looks like an old old cigarette machine from back in the day. Safe. Spade door. It's two spade doors. And I don't know the combination of the safe. Yeah, the original game you had to 
You had to. There'd be a loading screen just like in the first two games for each room. Alright, if I don't see a red herb soon, I'll eat this green herb. Passage isn't open yet. He's in pain. We're both injured. Difference is, I'm doing something about it. It's another spade. Three spades. All right. Something in this room, but or if it has to do with the three things. them. Whew. Just like magic. Herbs treat on zombie wounds. That's not good. I right, pass the door. There's nothing. Okay, two doors. Ah! Record of events. September 25th, we're turning the station into a temporary shelter due to the massive sudden outbreak. All police personnel have been instructed to make the safety of the citizens their top priority as we try to accommodate as many of them as possible. September 25th, addendum. One of the refugees attacked us in the middle of the night, resulting in the death of one officer and injuring three others. The person, is, the person in question was quickly restrained. We believe this is simply a case of someone snapping under intense stress. September 26th. A mob attacked the station today, resulting in a number of casualties. A few survivors were able to make it safely behind the emergency shutters, but surrounded as we were, it'll be hard for any of us to escape this place. We're not sure if we can fix any of our comm equipment, so we remain cut from the outside world. Cut off from the outside world. September 27th. There was another clash on the west side of the station around 1 p.m. 12 people died. And there's only a handful of survivors left. Everything is falling into disarray here, David Ford. Operations room. Please do. Oh, lets me know the map is here. Well, I definitely want to get that. Jesus. Bloody map. All right. I'm not sure if it tells me all doors that are locked. Is this map floor one. Woo! A lot of rooms to explore. I'm not sure if it 
sure if I should have done that. I am finding more ammo though. So can I zoom in? Yeah. Okay. I hopped over. Through here. Three rooms. Four, five. And back to where I was. Okay. This is a fat one. Damn it. Wasting ammo sucks in the apocalypse. Okay, different locker rooms. This vaguely, different things I can. <laughs> Storage locker terminal memo. It appears the keypad to the locker's terminal is missing a few keys. I suggest the person responsible for this mess find some spare keys. Fix this right now. You know who you are, bastard. Who else fucked this up so badly? Fuck this. <laughs> Fuck this. Swearing in a police station memo. So I need to. Get, I can't. Do, I need those two keys for all some of these codes. And then do you just type in... Oh, it just says enter locker number. What kind of security system is that if I just can unlock any... Maybe it requires the key. Oh, oh God. Just great. Good Lord. I shot you once. You're coming back up. Really? You're the only guy that needed one bullet? God, they're coming. It's been an intense first hour. A lot of different things I can get, but I need the weapon. I have a weapons locker. Terminal lock, okay. West on it. Locked. West office. I like that. I like that the, uh, hey, nicely labeled too. This was a thing in the Resident Evil 3 original, I remember. Two gunpowders for handgun, gunpowder and a high grade yellow for shotgun. Two yellows for back. There's a lot of ammo left in the station, so make good use of any gunpowder you find. Different guns require different ammo, so pay attention to what you're combining when you're combining things or you won't get what you need.
Christian's report on September 28th, 2.30 in the morning. It's down to just me and three others. No weapons, no ammo, and too many skirmishes have drained us mentally and physically. We're not going to make it. Officer Phillips once suggested we get case through the sewers. Apparently there's a secret tunnel under this place left from its museum days. I brushed her idea off before, but now it's not sounding all that bad. Yeah, there's no proof that even a tunnel or that the sewers are, aren't infested with zombies. But I don't want to sit here and wait to die either. It's a long shot, but I'm going to find out what I can do about that tunnel. Elliot Edward. Edward. From Resident Evil Zero. Edward. You died at the beginning of Resident Evil Zero. Rebecca, the forest is full of zombies and monsters. Zombies and monsters? Oh my. Rookie's first assignment. Is that me? Leon Kennedy. We're putting you on a very special case for your first assignment. Your mission is to unlock your desk. Oh, this is hazing. Your, <laughs> your mission is to unlock your desk. The key to your success is in the initials and our first names. And put the letters in order in order of our desks. There are two locks, one on each side of your desk. Make sure you get them both. Basically, your first task is to remember your fellow officers' names, but you figured that much out, right? Good luck, Leon. By the way, it might take a little work to get Scott to get Scott to give you a straight answer. Lieutenant Branna. Who the hell's Scott? Scrawled in the corner between the drops of blood. Be glad you're not here, rookie. Um I am here. I am. Maybe this was done a while back because they said Leon did say he was supposed to arrive a week ago, and then I guess shit went down and uh, Resident Evil. Okay. Oh god. Ah! Jesus! Son of a bitch! What the fuck? God, how many times has this game already scared me? It's still the first hour. Welcome, Leon. Oh, I threw a welcome party for me. Spade door. I want to unlock that stuff. Where, I hear zombies. So in order of de is the order of their names on the desk or something? I remember the initials because we have a uh, three letters. Was it last name? I think. So, let me read the article again. The initials and put the lockers of our desks. Oh, first names. I don't, maybe the left side in order and then the right side in order. So, left or right? And for Neil, Elliot, N E, David Ford. I read his thing earlier. N E D, Ned, Hardly Hay, M. Rita. M R. Where's your name? Name tag, name plaque. There it is. George Scott. So G. R 
5G, MRG. Cool. Give me some ammo or health. A clip. Wait, high capacity. Shorts your load time too. Okay. It's an upgrade. If I can combine. Yeah. Now I hold 24. Okay. Well, let's pretty much wrap up the first hour. Ah! I also have my, you know, headset right in my ear. Oh, God. Oh! What time? I heard someone rummaging. Okay, I want to know about these safes. No safe. Well. Guess that's the locked door. I don't have the spade door. Um, the only way is that just is that, is that the path the pathway? Yeah. Okay, it's considered its own room. This hallway, even though it's part of this. Shit. Yeah. Windows, keeping the riffraff out. Riffraff, street rat, scoundrel, take that! You fucking riffraffs. I steal only what I can afford. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save it at this, or you know, stop the hour here. I play one more hour tonight. Okay. Red herbs. Type red herbs. Okay, good stuff. Too much good stuff. Comb contains evidence. Do not leave out. Combine. Yeah. Guess I put the film there. Dark room sink. Okay. Gunpowder com I can combine. Much more bullets. All right, I got 48 bullets. Much better than I was off at the beginning. Uh, how about just not better than the herbs? This is more or less the same stuff. Green herbs for healing, blue herbs for poison. Red herbs can be combined, blah, blah, blah. Strengthen one's constitution. Mixing blue, oh, something new. Mixing blue and red can produce something that will strengthen my constitution. There's the potential these herbs and their ability to heal the human body for the research is to yield even more fascinating results. Well, now I'm curious about that. All right, saving and quitting this hour. And I can save as much as I want without ink ribbon. All right, that was fun and scary. Peace out.